Have you ever been a part of a project where the project ended over budget or way over budget, but no one could explain the main reason behind the project being over budget? One of the main reasons behind that could be absence of a competent and skilled cost control engineer. In our today's video, we will discuss about the main responsibilities of a cost control engineer and what skills should a cost control engineer have. A cost control engineer is responsible for controlling the project costs. This includes planning, developing, controlling, and forecasting the project's budget. The primary goal of a cost control engineer or a cost controller in a project is to minimize the deviation from the budget and ensure that the project is completed within the approved budget. The main skills that should be there in the cost control engineer is to be knowledgeable in the total cost management concepts and terminologies. Secondly, the cost controller or cost control engineer should know how to allocate the budget and establish a cost baseline. Number three, he should be very well aware of earned value management in projects and efficiently carry out the calculations required to obtain the values from earned value analysis or earned value management. Moreover, the cost control engineer should be able to analyze the cost report. Besides that, he should be able to detect issues in the report and effectively communicate the project's cost performance to the project stakeholders, be it the project manager, the project management team, or the senior management in the organization. And lastly, the cost control engineer should be very well familiar with one of the project management tools. It could be Microsoft Excel, Microsoft Project, or Primavera, or any other tools used by different organizations. In this slide, as you can see briefly, a cost control engineer utilizes engineering principles and judgment to project, assess, and control costs. Besides that, he or she should be able to plan, schedule, and manage projects. Throughout the project, a cost control engineer have different things to do. In the pre-project stage, or before the project begins, in project management terminology we call this the initiating phase of the project, the cost control engineer provides the high-level estimates for the resources required for the project to be completed. As you know, before we get into a project, we have to do a series of analysis. It could be net present value analysis, it could be return of investment, internal rate of return, or payback period. The cost control engineer helps the business analyst of the organization in order to carry out those calculations. Besides that, he or she provides a high-level project budget, which could be measured against the revenue or the benefits from the project. And then a decision is made upon the project whether it should be undertaken by the organization or not. In the planning stage, once the project is undertaken by the organization, the cost control engineer calculates the costs for activities which sums up to control accounts in order to obtain the total cost for the project. Throughout the executing phase of the project, as you know, the raw data is provided from the site or, or the project to the project management team. At this stage, the cost control engineer collects the necessary data and information from the site and the project and incorporates it into the project reports. In the monitoring and controlling phase of the project, which in most cases goes in parallel with the executing phase of the project, the raw data is analyzed and changed into information to be represented in reports to the project stakeholders. In this stage, the cost control engineer along the project management team performs the earned value management where they obtain the values for cost performance index to complete performance index and other types of forecasts needed for the project. In the last stage of the project or the closing stage, 
The cost control engineer plays a crucial role in preparing the final report of the project. He provides the necessary information of the project in terms of cost, how much was it planned, and how much is actually expended. The necessary documents and plans that the cost control engineer will need throughout the project is the cost management plan. In this plan, it's explained in detail that how the costs will be estimated, how they will be monitored and controlled, and how and what template they will be reported to other stakeholders of the project. Next is the bill of quantity, which in most cases and most organizations is prepared by the cost control engineer. In this document, the quantities for each resource is given. Besides that, the cost for each item is given and the total cost for the projects obtained using the bill of quantity. Next thing that the cost controllers or cost control engineers mostly interact with is the resource breakdown structure or RBS. This document shows which type of resources and what quantity will we need. And lastly, there might be other organizational process assets like templates, like systems, like way of estimating costs might be used by the cost control engineer. I hope you like the contents in the video. If you found them informative, please don't forget to subscribe to the YouTube channel and like this video. Thank you very much.